Hey, Nathan Daniel here with my Aunt Debbie in honor of World Hepatitis Day. This year's theme is to find the missing millions. Today is the day to combine our voices for the 325 million and honor the 1.4 million who die each year from Hep B and C. There is an estimated 290 million people who are unknowingly infected. While it is important to get screened regardless, according to the CDC, here are the most common risk factors. If you are a healthcare professional who's been exposed to infected blood, if you have ever injected illicit drugs, if you are currently HIV positive, if you have ever received a piercing or a tattoo in an unclean environment, or using unsterilized equipment, if you have uh, received a blood transfusion before 1992, if you've ever received uh, clotting factor concentrates before 1987, or have ever received hemodialysis treatment for an extended period of time, if you were born to a mother who was infected with viral hepatitis or were ever in prison, and finally, any of the baby boomers who were born between 1945 and 1965. Uh, this is an age group with the highest rate of infection, and it's still unknown why. There are ways to prevent hep C infection. Stop using illicit drugs, particularly if you are injecting them. And if you use illicit drugs, seek help, but always make sure you are using clean paraphernalia. Be cautious about body piercing and tattooing. If you choose to undergo piercing or tattooing, look for a reputable shop, ask questions beforehand about how the equipment is cleaned. Make sure the employees use sterile needles. If employees won't answer your questions, look for another shop. Practice safe sex. Don't engage in unprotected sex with multiple partners or with any partner whose health status is uncertain. Do not share personal hygiene products and practice safe bloodborne pathogen practices. As we continue throughout today, we're going to continue posting information about viral hepatitis, including prevention, testing, and treatment right here on this channel. Please remember to like and share so we can reach the missing millions and do our small part in ending viral hepatitis for good. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time, remember, get tested, get treated, and get cured.